Ford just revealed a pretty awesome new version of the Mustang Mach-E. This one leans into a trend that I thought may have been just about finished, but it looks like factory safari style builds are sticking around a bit longer. Allow me to introduce to you the Ford Mustang Mach-E Rally. Details on this one are still scarce, but it will be a production model that you can buy and not just a concept special one-off. Ford used the hill climb stage that is the Goodwood Festival of Speed to reveal the rally, which is a pretty proper place to do so. So what can we tell from the pictures and videos? The Mach-E rally looks to sit a bit higher than the standard car. It's packing a pretty sweet rear spoiler out back, the wheels look the part, and they're wearing nice knobby tires as well. The lower fascia and side sills look quite a bit more aggressive, and it's pretty cool to see a tow hook on the nose of this thing too. There's a set of fog lights up front in the nose as well. Inside the cabin, the front seats look similar to the ones on the Mach-E GT Performance Edition, just maybe with a bit more sporting style to the back of them. To highlight this new model, Ford enlisted the help of M Sport team driver Ott Tanak. He won the World Rally Championship in 2019. He won Rally Sweden this year in his M Sport Puma, and he's currently in a very tight battle for the second place spot on the driver's rankings for this season. Tanak will run the car up the Goodwood Hill. Hopefully he puts a wheel or two into the grass or dirt so we can see this thing carry some speed on a bit of an off-pavement dash. Regardless, the Ford Mustang Mach-E Rally will be made available to order later this fall. There's no word yet on price, just as there's no word on performance or range. If I had to speculate, I'd assume some manner of powertrain setup similar to what's in the Mach-E GT or GT Performance. So that means hopefully we see at least that same output of 480 horsepower and up to 634 pound-feet of torque. That also unfortunately means you can expect a hefty price tag as well. The GT starts over 60,000 and a GT performance adds another five grand to the bottom line. Still, it is cool that Ford is making a car like this. Factory built rally specials are a rare thing and I'm always a sucker for them. That's why I love cars like the GR Corolla on the lower end of the spectrum and on up to the truly insane Porsche 911 Dakar and the wicked Lamborghini Storado. And yes, Subaru needs to hurry and give the world a fresh WRX STI. For now, it's cool to see another option in the rally bred space. And I have to imagine it will be quite a thrill to send the Ford Mustang Mach-E rally slinging sideways down a gravel road. Hopefully there's some extra underbody protection for the battery.